Ed here with the Digital Digest, and today I wanted to share a quick video about an ideal accessory for the Microsoft Surface Pro 8. For those of you that have been following my coverage of the i7 and i5, this is the i7, 16 gigs of RAM, a half terabyte SSD, 1900 US dollars without the keyboard pen combo. So what is the best accessory for this? Well, if you follow my channel, you know I cover a lot of Thunderbolt uh, hubs, uh, docking stations, NVMe, uh, SSDs, enclosures. Uh, but today we're looking at something that I feel, even though it's not Thunderbolt, is ideal. And that is the Acasis 10-in-1 NVMe hub. So this was a Kickstarter that I covered a while back. It no longer is in a Kickstarter phase, but I'm sure you should be able to find this somewhere and I will try to do my best. Um, it's what I've been using with the Surface Pro 8 and it's really ideal because it has pretty much everything you could possibly want in a compact form. Uh, and even though it's not Thunderbolt 4, of course, works uh, with near Thunderbolt 4 performance on the Surface Pro 8. So we've got two USB-A ports. Uh, right now I've got my Logitech G502 connected uh, and one is a 3.0, another 3.1, and then a Type-C 3.1. Then we have an audio combo jack, two card readers, of course a micro and full size. Um, not the fastest, but certainly up to snuff uh, on par with the majority of laptops not quite as fast as the, the card reader in the Omen 17 right now. And then right here, we have a slot for an NVMe drive. So if you do want to expand your storage, like I've been talking about, this is a perfect way to do that. Um, not the easiest thing in the world to get one in there, but once you have it locked in, you're good to go. And I've thrown an eight terabyte uh, Sabrent in there. Yes, you heard right, eight terabyte. So that kind of makes this a dream device to use but that will require power. Once you throw an NVMe in here, it's not going to self-power like we're doing right now because the Surface Pro, if you may have noticed, is not connected to a power source and this still works beautifully. Then on the left side, we have Ethernet and we have HDMI out, um, which is nice to have, not necessary, but certainly nice. And then here where we have the um, actual Type-C connection to the Surface, we also have, as you can probably see right there, power delivery uh, with 100 watts. Um, trying to get that in focus. So that's another nice touch and the LED for activity. So again, this is the Acasis um, NVMe dock. Uh, if I can find it, of course, I will link it. It was $100 in the Kickstarter campaign. And this is, in my opinion, an ideal hub for the Surface Pro 8. It keeps it light. It keeps it flexible and it gives you everything that the Surface Pro 8 is missing in terms of I.O. natively and does it all with a single uh, Type-C port. Uh, but stay tuned for additional coverage of other Thunderbolt accessories that I will roll out uh, in the very near future. Any questions or comments, please feel free to post them, hit that like button, and as usual, please feel free to subscribe and please stay safe. Later.